Hi, I'm Ryan Helge. I'm the Activities Director at Sartell High School, and I'm super happy to show you our new building today and walk you through some of the activity spaces. Uh, some of the highlights you're going to see, our main event gym, as well as our auxiliary gym, which provides um, not only a great competition venue, but a great practice facility for our student athletes. Um, our pool, which I think is really state of the art and one of the best pools that you're going to see at a high school venue. Um, our 5,000 square foot weight room, which I think is really a game changer for Sartell. And then we'll walk you down to the performing arts studio and show you that space for um, our students as well. That'll really give us a chance to showcase some of the great talent we have. Welcome to our main event uh, gym. We have ability to seat about 2,000 people here, which I think gives us a nice mix of having a really big venue, but also having an atmosphere um, in a lot of our regular season events. You can see we have three full courts here, which is a great thing for practice, as well as a lot of seating in room in between courts. Um, watching our volleyball team work around in here, it's just, it's additional space that's really well utilized. Um, all of the hoops are uh, come down on one system, so it's really a huge benefit in terms of changing the facility um, at a really quick pace for our coaches as well as our phi ed teachers. And then a cool feature as well is that all of the hoops will telescope except the main gym down to eight feet so we can bring a whole bunch of kindergartners in here and do some really cool um, community-based things as well. Uh, one of the other cool features that a lot of people notice when they walk in here is we have uh, Two huge video boards, you can see one across the way and then a larger one up above me that's 18 by 10 um, that I think really will give us the ability to have just really cool game-like experiences and feature our student athletes. So we're really excited about the gym and I think this is going to be a great place for our uh, Sabre teams to compete for a lot of years. Welcome to our auxiliary gym. Our auxiliary gym will be used to hold some lower level games and there is some limited seating but it's mostly a practice space for us. Um, behind me you can see one of our cool features is the um, fly-in volleyball nets. These go into the ceiling much like traditional baskets do and then fly in um, with the same system that runs all of our baskets in here. Um, we have five hoops for basketball again that all telescope down to the eight feet so they can be used for youth things as well. And one of the other cool features above me that I think is great for our uh, spring teams is we have a double batting cage that we can drop down, we can put back up so we can get some use out of it in the off season as well. Our eight lane pool I think is, is an awesome uh, addition to this building. You notice that it has the diving, uh, the Near the diving board, there is a bubbler, which has been a really great thing for our divers in the first couple days of practice. We have eight competition lanes. We have a new video board in there. And I think just aesthetically, it's gonna be an awesome and really welcoming place to watch a swim meet um, with some natural light on the end as well. So um, our swimming pool is another great space in our new building. Sartell Fitness Center, uh, High School Fitness Center, I think is one of the best uh, features of our new building. It's certainly one of the best upgrades for our activities department. We have 10 different stations you can see behind me that are made to bench, squat, and clean on. Um, we have a great floor in here that's multi-purpose so we can not only lift off it with our, our cleans, but we can also do movement stuff in the middle. Um, we have 10 treadmills that you get to use um, right up against natural light that looks outside. We have eight ellipticals. And, and really, I think it's just an inviting space for kids to work out in. Um, Weights don't lift themselves, so we still need to put in the work, but I think certainly if you're a student athlete who wants to improve, this is a great space to do that, and we're really excited about how this can kind of change things for our activities and our athletics teams. Our outdoor activity spaces are really great. We have two performance fields over here where we're gonna play a lot of soccer this year. Um, in the future someday, we'll play lacrosse as well as football. We have a baseball field here. We'll still play a lot of our games at St. Cloud Orthopedic, but this will be a great practice space for us. Um, behind me, we have a varsity um, softball field as well as two other practice fields with the ability to someday complete that entire wheel. And then we have five practice fields um, right next to each other. Our fine arts and, and music students really have great spaces here at the new Sartell High School. You're in our performing arts center, which um, really is just a beautifully and well done um, seating area that's got can seat about 800. There's three different areas, um, a lower, a middle, and a balcony kind of to accommodate any size crowd. We have um, a scene shop right behind us where our on-set scenes will be made. They'll roll through double doors. We also have the ability to fly in some sets here. Um, and then just great acoustics and, and a great place for our students to perform. This is right next to our music suite, which will ho hold our choir, our orchestra, and our band, as well as some private practice rooms. So I'm very excited for the new opportunities that provides um, our students that uh, excel in theater and music um, to really take advantage of these new spaces to be the best they can.